It's Cash Banuka! Hello, my lumpies and germs. Sorry for accidentally pressing the wrong button. <laughs> um, that's what you come to expect from professional Cadicorous Twitch.tv streamer. How are we all doing? We all good? Thank you, Toggle Jam, for raiding us with three Banookas already. Jeez, I don't deserve that before the stream's even started. That's how we do it in my oh, garden. you even asked who tooted in the chat. That's that's that, that's currently the poll who tooted. Both. Both one. What, me and Stan or That's me and Keris? That's how we do it in my garden. What? Um, Skynix Dystoxia. Thank you for subbing. Harper, 200 bits. Hey, Caddy, Keris family. Hope you're doing well and that this game is less rage-inducing than Hackboy's slow misadventures. Now, Slackboy wasn't rage-inducing. It was boring. Um, So I just had to stop and move on. And Hinomood88. Thank you for the sub. But anyway, today, everybody, is a very special day. This is my PC screen. It's my desktop. There's my mouse. <laughs> We are going to be moving the mouse over to this little program here. It's Rayman Redemption. Does that logo look a bit familiar to you? Well, if you don't know what Rayman Redemption is, it's a totally free fan-made remake from the ground up of Rayman 1. The classic on the PS1, which I have nostalgic history with, and I love it dearly, but I also hate it as much as I love it because the game is That's bullshit. How we do it in my garden. And I I'm interested to see what this what this remake fixes because um not only just for like 60 FPS and widescreen, which would be nice anyway, but like how they fix the whole trial and error bullshit. Does the wider screen mean that we can see more coming up? That's how we what, do it in what my do they garden. fix? That's what I'm interested in because there's, I mean, I did a, vi a video on Rayman 1 years ago, so you can see what problems I have with the game by watching that. Too much trial and error, too much bullshit, and if you lose all your continues, which you only have five, so you have three lives, lose all of them, you lose a continue, and then if you lose five continues, your game is dead, you have to start from the beginning all over again. And it's not the smallest game in the world. So Rayman 1 is a classic, but it's also a piece of shit. Um, <laughs> so I'm interested to see what this does. Scott Thunder resubbed, thank you. Richardo, 200 bits. I'm proud of the patrons voting for something truly special. I'll, you'll swear I'll love it. Oh, well, thank you very much. Deadly Sakuras, thank you for resubbing. 200 bits from Cold Jack. Love the streams, Caddy. I'm excited to watch tonight. I'm glad. But anyway, let's... I can't wait any longer. I'm, I'm going to be playing this as well. Oh, Stanley's being a bastard. No, yeah, you're right. It's triggering, yeah. Every time I start streaming, he needs to go out for a wee, even though he went out like five minutes ago. I'm going to be using... Um, a DualShock 4 plugged in via USB into my computer. 
to play this game because I hear that that's compatible. So I can't wait any longer. We have to do it. I'm excited. Let's see what happens. Okay, immediately I love this game because they've taken the um, um, the, <laughs> the 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 copyright warning on PS1 games. And they've reworded it, and they've just done the same style. Rayman Redemption is a fan game and has no affiliation with Ubisoft whatsoever. Rayman and all original assets belong to Ubisoft. Yes, I'm sure that will hold up in court. Um, support the original Rayman series by buying Rayman games. This game should not be sold. Press any key to continue. Well. Um, yeah, I mean, we need to come up with another nickname, don't we? Rayman Redemption. This is this game is R Raymond. Wait, right, no. No, not Raymond Roly Poly. There you go. That's the name of this game. Rayman Redemption is Raymond Roly Poly. That is the game we're playing today. Also, I want to um, shout out the guy that made this game, who I follow on Twitter. Rymany, his name is. He's a guy from Finland. Very, very, I've only had a couple of interactions with him. Very friendly guy. You can link him to his Twitter in the chat if you want to. Um, but yeah, um, I'm interested to see. His name is nearly Rayman. Okay, we've got a bit of a redo of the main theme. No, I'm not sure. Not sure about that. Can we change that? The, the sound effects are all the same. Um, it's in widescreen. It looks to be 60 FPS, ju judging by the background. Thank you, Alina, for $10 donation. Hello from Russia. Finally managed to get to the stream. Thank you so much, Russia. God, I didn't know Russia was a person. Thank you. Um, Z-Man Show 200 bits. What's up? I've um, been grinding like all your videos lately. Thank you. Got me way into Crash. Just bought an OG Xbox today just to play Twin Sanity. Oh, good. Don't play it on the 360. Um, but but I'm a, but you're a huge fan. Thank you so much. Very kind of you. But anyway, let's have a look. Sound settings. Uh, music volume, sound effects volume, Ting style, PS1. Uh, awesome. Um, so does that mean we can have... Oh, cool. Oh, it's got to be the PS1 one. It's got to be the little ding. Yeah, it's got to be the PS1. Well, they both sound the same. The beep and the voice sound like a bubbly fart. So, yeah, I'll just go with the voice, I suppose. Victory jingle, new or classic. Oh, classic. What? Da -da 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 -da. It's got to be classic. Um, um, Fist sound effect, classic or new. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we got to have that. Okay, so view settings, aspect ratio is fine. Camera style, new or classic. I'm going to go with new because the camera is one of the problems I have. The sprites are too big. It's too zoomed in for my liking. Full screen. View Bob on platforms. I don't know who Bob is. Bonus Bob? Bob Hoskins? Is Bob Hoskins in this game? On, off. Um, it was default off, so I'm going to keep it off. Um, yeah, camera pan speed. I'm going to leave that at default as well. Other settings. Helicopter style hold. Oh, dude, yeah. Run style hold. Yes, thank you. Font style classic. Clear. Oh, no, that's ugly. Classic or clear. Oh, God, yeah, classic. Quick respawn off. No, I'll leave that off. It's fine. Auto save on map. Thank the fucking Lord. Yes, please. Um, skin effects. What, do you get to take Rayman's face off and stick it on yourself? Timer in every level off. Yes, please. Time of death. Yeah, I don't need any of that. Yeah, animated. Shop bonuses. Yep, sounds good to me. Gamepad setup. Well, it's using my DualShock 4. It seems to be working. Oh, it even recognizes it. Oh, dude, that's cool. It even recognizes I'm using a DualShock 4. X square, R2, circle, L1, R1. Oh, nice. Oh, not many games do that. I, the only one, the only other one I can think of that does that is... um. Um, the Insane Trilogy on Steam. That does it. That changes the Xbox um, same symbols into PS4 if you use a DualShock 4 on Steam. But I don't think any other game does that. That's cool. Keyboard setup, I'm not using it. So here we go, everybody. The um, long-awaited prequel to Red Dead Redemption. Ray Raymond Redemption. <laughs> when J yeah, I did, I did start something. Yeah, I thought I started something. I literally haven't done anything, as you can see from the percentages. I think I just, yeah, I thought I did, but let's get rid of them. No, I don't want to start that. No. Yeah, I did like one level just to see, but it was so long ago, so I don't even remember what the hell happened. Um, yeah, erase it. Let's just start again. Um, oh, actually, no, let's go with a new name. Let's go with... Um, Uh, but it's, actually, no. No, I don't like... 
No. Wait a minute. Whilst we're casual, you'll have infinite lives, can't get a game over, one-up grants tings instead of lives. Um, in classic mode, your lives are limited and you can get a game over. Demise. One-up statues are rigged. Check choke points are gone. You start with less health. Only play this if you're looking for a challenge. Okay, in cla has anybody in the chat played this before? Because what I want to know is, does classic mode mean that you get a you lose a continue? Because I can work with game overs and shit. I can work with game overs and losing lives. I just want to know in my garden. if there's any um, if there's any like um, continues. <laughs> I recommend classic. Demise is OG Rayman, yeah, that sounds that sounds right. No, we're not doing a poll because we're not doing demise. <laughs> not doing demise. Not doing it. Demise, demise. Everyone's saying demise, no. Okay, that's all I need to know. I can work with game overs and continues and shit. I just want to know if there's um no um get like continues and shit, because that's when I that's when I that's when I don't like Rayman. So I'll go classic. Ifrit, thank you for the nine-month resub. Very kind of you. Rabid won 800 bits. Good luck on your redemption. Have you seen the speedruns of this game? Not gonna make your luck. You say bugger me. How is that possible? Oh, this is taking me back. Oh, it's all full screen. Yeah, I didn't watch any of this on my first two save files. It, uh, Ant Dude just told me to play the game. And, um... Okay, maybe it's just images. Yeah, it's not animated, is it? Also, that voice, um, that's the one I'm used to. The American one, I don't know, and I don't, I'm not used to. But yeah, Ant Dude told me to check it out and play it, so I didn't actually play much. I just played one level and I skipped all the shit because I just wanted to see a very quick idea of what they did. Um, and that's it. So this is all new to me. I haven't seen any of this. Richardo, 200 bits. Game overs are infinite. It simply means you'll start from the current level on the first stage. Oh, that's fine. That's fine. I can work with that. In this now unbalanced world, strange phenomena begin to occur. Freaks and hostile characters appear. So they managed to get all the original voice files, so I wonder what they've done with the music. I hope that I hope it's not all redone like the menu. They definitely need a hero to save them now. Also, yes, you heard that correctly, everybody. The name of the bad guy in this game is Mr. Dark, who has um Uncle Nasty as his um as his friend. Mr. Bad is another one. So this bit's animated. Interesting. It sounds like Spongebob. I don't know if it'd be Tom Kenny because this is an early 90s game. I don't know if he was in the consciousness of me media at that point. I don't know. There's Mr. Dark, who when I was younger, thought I thought he had a trunk with glass on the end. But it's no, he's holding up things. He's holding up um, um, binoculars. Anyway. Here we go. Who's ready for a nostalgia overload? Do you know what? Loading times is not even something I considered. They've got the original drums. Here we go. Check it out. It's Rayman 1. But fucking look at it. And we've got... Okay. Oh, I didn't even know we had that. Okay, again, like I said, I played this for like five seconds when I first downloaded it. I didn't even... We can hang as well, so we don't have power-ups to get. So we can hover. Can we run already? We can. Oh, my God. Oh, my jeez. This is amazing. And the music's the same. Walk up and uh, jump with the movement keys. You can customize the controls and the options. Okay, well, I've already done that. So does that mean I can grab that P? Ah, oh, no, they thought about that. I've got 10 lives as well. This is... I can still do that. That's the most important part of the Rayman 1. Dude, this is amazing. It is so good. <laughs> it's so good. I love how at the beginning it's like, by the way, Ubisoft owns Rayman, blah, 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 fucking blah. Um, d or make sure you buy Rayman's games. In fact, why don't why don't Ubisoft hire Rymany? Why don't you fucking give him a job and make him... Just, just ask, just get royalties on this. I would buy this. This is free. Why do Nintendo and all these other companies not do this? I think Sonic Mania is the only example where fan creations of classic games have been redone better than the originals and then they end up getting a job out of it. 
Oh, there's a new animation for the fist. Oh, sweet. Oh, this is so cool. Oh, God, the momentum and the physics and it, it feels exactly like classic Rayman, but it just feels way more responsive. Oh, my dude. Oh, my dude. Also, sorry, I missed a load of bits. Everyone was being way too nice. Um, Chosen Bridge, 200 bits. Hello again. Managed to catch another stream. Rayman Legends is one of my favorite games of all time. What do you think of it? Yes, it's one of the best platformers I've ever played. I agree. Super Maze, 300 bits. Dr. Bad is here to kidnap all of Raymond's kids. Yes, he is. And they're all little balls with le with feet. Weeb Master Boy, 200 bits. Fun fact, the parent company of Midas Interactive and Phoenix Games is also the studio behind Shrek's Birthday Bash and Simpsons Skateboarding. I didn't know that, but that explains a lot. Rabbit One, 200 bits. Tom Kenny was playing Heifer from Rocker's Modern Life in 95, so it could be possible. Okay, maybe Keras was right again. You seem to hear SpongeBob where no one else does, honey, don't you? Go, Raymond! Oh, look at that. Are they going to be mean enough to put a death thing here? Yeah, I didn't think they'd do that. I'm just seeing if there's any secrets. Oh, okay. Well, that is a secret as far as I'm concerned. Is that going to get annoying? Ah! Nice. Oh, okay, so they open up straight away. Okay, nice. They don't do the little animation thing. Is that going to get annoying? I think it might. I don't want Rayman to sound like he just stabbed an elephant, so I think I'll um, turn that off. <laughs> Skid sound effect off. Yeah, thank you, game. Um, very kind of you. Does it, has it gone? Yeah, that's better. That's better. Okay. <laughs> Manga King, thank you for 200 bits. Catching this during my lunch break. Um, hope you and the family are doing well. We are, thank you. Well, that's new. Well, yeah. Um, super happy right now because Disney Plus is getting all five seasons of the original Muppets. Yes, I, I tweeted about it. I knew. Would you ever consider doing a video about Jim Henson properties? Nah, maybe not. There's not enough for me to go on. Harper Onions, 200 bits. Mr. Nasty is actually the name of the video of the game I'm, the game I'm trying to make. Yeah, but these guys were trying to be serious. Mr. Dark is a terrible name if you're doing it in a kind of tongue-in-cheek way. Mr. Dark sucks, because he's not even a good villain. Like, you can have a funny named villain, but just do something interesting with him. I can't tell you how nice it is to have the run from the beginning. For anyone that's played the original Rayman. Can I get up here? Yeah, l most of the game's um, problems in terms of, like, control and feeling like you can't make certain jumps and falling off of bottomless pits and not being able to move quick enough from obstacles that appear from nowhere off of the end of the screen when you can't see them. All of that is removed by the fact that you can now run. What did that do? Rayman, what did it do? Tell me. Or play basketball with your own pelvis. Okay, that's also fine. Okay, yeah, this all works the same. I don't need to press up or anything. It's not like Donkey Kong Country. Okay, so this is the level where the little... um. The little blue midges come out, isn't it? Oh, there they are, the little blue midges. Look, let's go. What's that for? That's how spring? we do it in my garden. Hmm. Not, I don't know what that is, but it's got eyes. And anything with eyes must be evil. Basil, thank you for the 10 month resub. 10 months, Christ almighty. Can I still get them in the cheap way? Yes, I can. All right. Oh, the music and everything. Do you know what? Okay, I know, again, I only played this level, and I can say wholeheartedly, I haven't even got to the hard levels yet, but I can say just based on this, this is, yeah, there's no point playing the original Rayman anymore. There just isn't. It, except for nostalgia. Like, I can, I can understand wanting to go back to Crash 1 when you have the Insane Trilogy, because they, they look different, they sound different, they feel different, but this looks, sounds, feels the same, but is just 10 times better than the original. So, so there's absolutely no need to go back. This is everything that you could ever want if you're a Rayman 1 fan, including Spindly Johnny over there. Come on. That's how we do it in Come on, Spindly darling. Green. Bye bye, Spindly Green. Axel F92, thank you for the two month resub. Super Maze, 200 bits. What did you think about the villains from the second and third Rayman games? I never played Rayman 3. Um, the second one um, is an awesome 3D platformer. I've done a video on it. Um, the pirates are pretty cool. Um, and I do like how the game opens up with. Um, I think I need that spring eye thing, don't I, to get up there? Yeah, I like how the game opens up with um, like the, the slave ship, and then you get a, a perfect idea of. 
exactly how bad the situation is and how awful the bad guys are and shit. Yeah, dude, Ryman, he needs a job at Ubisoft, or at least they need to license this game off of him and pay him a lot of money. This needs to be a Christian Whitehead situation with Sonic. He needs to make the next Rayman game. He did this in his spare time for nothing, and you can play it for nothing. It's free. Go and get it. I've only played, what, 10 minutes of it? 15 minutes of it. Play it. Get it, play it, love it. And don't, I was going to say, play, get it, play it, love it, buy it, but it's free, so don't buy it. If someone's selling it to you, you're being ripped off. And I demand you call the authorities. That's how we do it in my garden. That is, isn't it? Weepington, thank you for the one month gift sub. That is really kind. Anything up here for my use? God, so we've got a massive load of health points there. So I guess we can just keep on adding to it or... I don't know, maybe it's armor, armor or something? I'm not sure. God, this run is a godsend. The problem is, in the original, by the time you get the run as a power-up... Oh, do we still do the... Wait a second, do we still do the... Ah! He does! He does the... Ah! 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 Sorry, honey. That's how we do it in my garden. There was someone at your school... Okay, Keris just told me there was someone in your class at school that looked just like Rayman. Was he in a freak show by any chance? Was his name Raymond? Oh, okay, that's fair. What if he's watching? That would be sad. Sorry, sorry, Raymond. You look like Rayman. I've also noticed we've got golden fists um, by picking up that golden glove. Um, so we don't that's only have the sparkly gold look. I don't know how I feel about that. I quite like Rayman just looking the same and the fist attack looking different on its own, but it's fine. $4.11 donation from Boy My Life. Just bought a PS1 with a copy of Rayman, but the disc won't load the first level. Well, then you've been had, I'm afraid. It's an old game. I mean, it's, it's going to be difficult to find a working copy. Human, thank you for subbing. And Regal, thank you for subbing. Very kind of you. I just discovered what Prime subs were the other day. Oh, wait, there's different levels. Oh, so you can get different speed levels for the... Oh, dude, this man is a genius. Rimini, change your name legally to Rayman. You deserve it more than Rayman himself does. Yeah, go and, go and follow him on Twitter. The dude's a legend. Rimini, which I'm pretty sure is R-Y-E-M-A-N-N-I. Or maybe it's Rimani. I don't know. I mean, that's what I'm going by. Can we do the crouch and the crawl? Yes. And it's immediate. Oh my god. See, this is the kind of shit that needed to be addressed. This is the stuff where in my video, if they had all of this stuff, I would never have complained once. I would never would have complained. Okay, so just so that you have an understanding, in the original game, you can crawl like this, right? And you use the shoulder buttons to do it, right? But in the original, if you're in the middle of a crawl and you need to escape from another obstacle, like let's just say... Oh my god. Oh Jesus. Oh my god, no. Okay, get behind them. Um, yeah, in the original, if you're like ducking under some sort of spiky wall or something, so you can't stand up, you have to crawl or have to duck, then if you need to move away from a bullet that comes from one end of the screen to the other, but you still have to crawl, in the original, you have a turning animation in the middle of the crawl, which takes about a second for you to start moving in the other direction, which in some boss fights make them nearly impossible, but they he's fixed it, it's gone. There's no... You just do it. So good. It's so good, guys. It's so good. Also, I'm so, I've just noticed on the stream it might be running really choppily. That is just my PC slash the stream. That is not the game. The game runs at 60 FPS flawlessly, so don't let that be an indicator of how bad the game is. Rabid1400 Bits did some research. Apparently The Magicians is voiced by Doug Rand, who did Glowbox in Rayman 2. Wow. Talk about range. Um, I'm not 100% sure if it's for all versions, but that's what I found. Well, there's there's different VOs for the intro of this game. The one I know, which is the European one, was the same one that you just heard here. And I don't know um, if... Because I know the American one sounds different. I know that for a fact. Oh, fuck. I wasn't paying attention to you. There's something up here I can do? Nope. So I'm pretty sure at this point... There we go. So can we get you in the water? And we can get another P from you. Nice. Red piss bubble. Thank you. 
<laughs> Very tasty. That's how we do it in my garden. See, okay, so in the original as well, I'm just going to be... Okay, so you see those bullets there? First of all, they would usually have mallets coming out the top, so the hitboxes on them were massive and took up basically half the screen. But also, they appeared out of nowhere off screen. So unless you knew they were coming, you couldn't react to them. But now they come off of the edge of the screen because you can see with the widescreen. I kind of miss the mallets, but I understand why they were taken out. Maybe later on in the game when those guys come back, maybe they redo it. I'm not sure. We'll see. Maybe there's the um, European voiceover of the magician at the beginning of the game because the um, Ryman is from Finland, so maybe he gets the same VO as what we did on the PAL version. Which is not a PAL problem. I think we did it cooler. Okay, don't don't grab me. Oh, thank you. I didn't think I okay. I didn't think that I'd be using the run as often as I am now. This is genuinely amazing. It's a platforming. It's a 2D platform when you can run, and I'm praising it. If you haven't if you haven't played the original Rayman, you don't know the pain. You just don't. You can't relate. <gasps> Present. Oh, how did you know it was Christmas? <gasps> That's how we do it in my garden. What was that? We got a skittle. We got a lime skittle. Thanks, game. I did think of Ribena with the berries, yeah. So did uh, did some did Tim have it on PS1 or something, or did you have it on PC? You had it. Oh, right on PS1. Ah. Oh. Yeah, the right. Yeah, no, I did as as a kid actually. Now that you say it. Ah. I'm so happy that they've got the <laughs> bag. I can't even do it. <laughs> Oh, wow. That's how we do it in my garden. Down with the ray, man. Um, Manga King, thank you for six month resub. Would you ever consider streaming the Borderlands games? No, no, I won't. Um, if you can remember who was your main, mine in two was Gage because I loved how broken she was. My main in two was Zero, and my main in the next one was um, Amara. Um, Seeker D12, thank you for the sub. Darth Sliske, I think that says, thank you for the sub. Oh, okay, so what does she do then? Because she would, at this point, she would give us the ability to use our fist, wouldn't she? Or the hanging. Hmm. Oh, yeah, by the way. Once again, it is Friday. You know what that means? It's Pop-Off Friday. Yeah, I had a fr I had fried dough last week because we had donuts. But it's Pop-Off Friday. These are Walker's Poppables barbecue rib flavor. They are delicious. They are the shit. They are the best crisps I've had. Sorry, potato chips um, that I've had in a long time. And you also get free ASMR. And you don't even have to pay for a Pornhub subscription. So you get everything. It's fine. Anyway, where are we? Oh, I thought, okay, in the options, when it said voice, I thought they were going to have voice actors. But no, I'm glad they've just got the pee 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 I'm Batilla the Fairy, I'm going to help you on your quest. Yeah, except you... It does sound like Chloe when you're asking her a question. Hey, Chloe, have you done the dishes yet? <laughs> you, you must find the three tomb totems. I thought that was some some sort of slur for a second. I, I couldn't quite read it from here. And release the prisoners within. They are helpful magical beings who are sealed away by Mr. Dark. <gasps> no! Not Mr. Dark. Who'd be coming next? Mrs. Mrs. Smell. First one is hidden deep in the jungle, guarded by the evil mosquito. Oh, they're referencing the bosses and everything. The second one is on the highest peak of the Blue Mountains, and the third one is hidden somewhere in the caves of Scops. Oh my god. Scops is like one of the worst bosses in the original, so I'm really curious to see. <laughs> Excuse you? <laughs> Honey, do you have coronavirus? <laughs> ha! Do you really think that it'll be that simple? Who are you? Oh my god! Are you a moustache with legs and arms? I'm Darktoon, Mr. Dark's right-hand man. He gave me the power to stop you. I'll finish you off before you can even start. I started 15 minutes ago, dude. You failed already. Rayman, take this. It will help you defeat him. 
You give me a big piss, red, red bloody piss bubble. Why don't, why don't you use that magical fist of yours to punch him, Batilla? I don't know, power, I think? Thank you. Oh my god, it's a boss! Oh my, okay. Oh my god, dude, dude. Oh, this is so fucking good. How the hell have Ubisoft- Ubisoft must know about this, and if- and they need to sell it on Steam and shit. Can you imagine this on Switch? It'll be like the best fucking thing ever. You'll never stop Mr. Dark. <laughs> what? Um, I mean, I did tag Ubisoft in a tweet when I played five minutes of this. But that's the best I could do. I haven't- I haven't got any contacts with Ubisoft. Oh my god, wow. <laughs> Super Maze, 200 bits. Dark Toon isn't social distancing or wearing a face mask. Kick his ass. <laughs> well, I can't kick his ass because that means I have to break social distancing. Magician's Challenges. Oh, is that that token I picked up? I also like this little checklist here. Shows you what you've done on what levels. Maybe I could even 100% it, which would be a first in Rayman 1 history for me. Never done that before. Oh, okay. Great, welcome to my Bounds level shop. The more magician tokens you collect, the more levels you will unlock. Okay. Jesus, so there's even more? Singing in the ju swinging in the jungle, sorry. It's not singing in the jungle, it's not the jungle book. Right. Oh shit, okay. We're running, okay. Oh, so we got original time trial -y things? Oh my lord. So this is as much a new game as it is an old game. Um, this is so good. And after Sackboy as well, it just goes to show, this game just goes to show how mediocre Sackboy was. Okay, right. God, the, there's no problem with the controls or anything. It's super responsive. The knockback isn't absolutely ridiculous. Everything from the original that I didn't like has been fixed. Oh my god, aside from you, Mr. Pickle. What the fuck? Oh shit, no! No, 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 I'm running out of time! That's a weird sound. Doesn't it usually go boom when you jump on those things? Am I running out of time? Go, go, go! Ooh. Whew. We did it, guys. Good. Press any key to continue. I will. Thank you so much. And that's it. We've done the first challenge. Hmm. I wonder what the point is. Even going from level to level is much faster. Because he runs. Wow. I know it's very early to say. I know it's ridiculously early to say. But the, the reason that I hold Rayman 1 in such high regard, despite thinking it's a really, really badly designed shit fest from the halfway point onwards and it's half great half terrible the the reason it goes down in my mind as a classic and a nostalgic love letter and everything oh those are the power-ups we unlock swinging and maybe the springs that we saw earlier so we don't get the the hover or the run or the fist which i never understood from the original you can't attack until you meet batilla once yeah you can't use your fist in the first game until you meet batilla very weird I knew there'd be something up here. But yeah, like the reason I've hold it, held it in such high regard um, is because mainly, well, the imagination, the, um, the imagination, the ideas of the gameplay and the presentation and the first half of it in general, the first third of it maybe. Um, so considering that like this has the same presentation, the same music, same visuals, but they run better, it looks better, it's widescreen, the music's the same. Um, the controls are familiar, but m much more finely tuned. The physics are much more manageable. You can run and jump and do all this. Because of all of that, this may be, and I know it's early, and I know I'm probably going to make a fool of myself, because we haven't got to the hard parts of the game yet, but I think this may be one of my favourite platformers ever. Yeah. I love this. Yes! I got the toenail! Hurrah! Isn't there a cage that pops up down there? 
I could I could swear there was a cage that popped up down there in the original. Maybe they got rid of it. Um, yeah, just the eyes in the cage. Yeah. But yeah, I'm 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 not even kidding because like I always, despite my better judgment, I always find myself going back to Rayman One because I just love the atmosphere, the mood, the look, all of that shit. No, there's there's no secret there. Um, so because um, this has the same of everything that I love from the first game, but everything that I dislike about it seems to have been improved, which should make the harder levels way more manageable and more fair, more importantly. They'll still be tricky, but they'll be fair. Then I'm confident in, my, in me saying that I think this may be one of the best platformers I've ever played. And it's free, and it's a fan-made thing, it's not official, and one dude did it in his spare time, so fucking... I'm a failure. That just puts things in, into perspective for me. I could have done a lot with my life, and instead, I'm playing something made by someone genuinely incredible. And all, all I'm doing is sitting on my stupid bum and playing it. That's all I'm doing. Oh my god. Okay, so I saw... How do we get a... Oh, there's a spring power there. I, I didn't see that. I don't remember them being in the original. I think that's new. Anything here? No? Okay. Yeah! Do -do 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 -do. <laughs> Ding! Now, there are some versions of the game that have, like, a, D a DJ disc scratch sound effect on that bit, and I don't like it. Um, I'm glad it's not in this one. Hmm. Oh. Bungie, thanks for 200 bits. Hope you're well. What do you think of Rayman 3? Haven't played it. I own it. Haven't played it. I hear I should. Everyone tells me I should. Yeah, I just hope that I don't have to eat my words later on in this playthrough. Because the hard levels are hard in the original because of multiple reasons. Firstly, because they're just hard in general. And secondly, because it's unfairly designed. The controls are not built for that kind of level design. There's too many inconsistencies and glitches, like when you get clipped on the ceiling in some level. When you get clipped on the ceiling in some levels, like, you immediately lose a life. Um, especially in auto-scrollers. So there's lots of problems with the original. Oh, and I forgot as well. Yeah, there's lots of problems with the original. Um, and I think it's mostly mechanical more than level design-wise. It's just because the level design doesn't match with the mechanics and the controls and the style of the PS1 original. That's why I, I hate it so much. And of course, the five continues, and then you have to start the entire game over again. You know all that rubbish. So, I'm imagining what the end, the, the final parts of the game were, are going to be like. I'm imagining it in my head right now, and I don't think it's going to be anywhere near as unfair as the original. So I'm confident in saying that this may be, fi this may fix every single problem I've ever had with the original and make the game actually worth looking into dead again. Ah. Don Vito, thank you for 200 bits. You should check out Skull Monkeys, Caddy. Oh, yeah, I've heard from that as well. It's basically if Ardman and the Oddworld team made a Rayman 1 game. Oh, okay. Claymation Side Scroller with best soundtrack of any PS1 game was sequel to a point and click adventure game called The Neverhood. Yes, I do know about The Neverhood as well. Thanks to Jordan underneath. And of course, the soundtrack. The soundtrack's classic. Oh. So I died, but I've got. Okay, so you just get you just get tings. Oh, okay. I always liked that they're called tings because as a kid I always imagined it as a Jamaican person saying things. You got the tings. So what's that there for? No, Stanley, you're not coming up. Thank you. Good boy. You. Yeah, like some of the, some of the jumps in the original are so. Not strict, but they're so, like, Rayman's movement is so restrictive in comparison to some of the jumps that the, the original expects you to make. But this game fixes that entirely with the fact that you can't only run jump from the beginning, but also do the, the hover. So no jump is going to be a problem unless I fuck up the timing, which I've done a few times. Which are entirely my fault and not because of the way that the game's structured and designed. Oh, Stanley. He's, he's being really ridiculous tonight, isn't he? Oh dear. Darth Silske, I think that's how you say it. 
or Sliske, sorry, one dollar. Been watching you on YouTube for a couple of months now. Rand YouTube randomly decided to push some of your older videos to my feed. Oh, I'm sorry. I apologize on YouTube's behalf because you should not be introduced to my stuff with my old stuff. Anything from 2020 onwards, I'm good with that. Um, been loving all of the videos and streams. Thank you for the entertainment and laughs. Well, for someone who's only known about me for a few months, I massively appreciate it, dude. Thank you so much. And I don't say dude because I'm assuming you're a guy. I just say dude in general. So we got... <gasps> oh my god, there's a cutscene! His name's Bzit! His name's Zid! Where's... Where's herpes and gonorrhea? Um, hey, who are you? Stay out of here. And he has a voice as well. Oh my god, it's like, it's like Banjo-Kazooie, but way cuter. I don't like the way his nose is like pulsing and like, it's like, it's like a, um, yeah, it's telescopic, isn't it? What's it called? Um, um, no, um, not ball bearing. I'm a fucking moron. I don't know. I can't think of, I can't think of, I can't think of it. But yeah, this is my home and I don't want any suspicious people here. Get lost or I'll sting you. <laughs> well, all those sound effects are still there. I was wondering if he's going to keep talking to us throughout the fight. Also, I didn't know that as a kid. Did you know that you can punch him in the middle of- <gasps> He's got new attacks! Oh, oh my god, he's jizzing. Oh Jesus, he's jizzing all over Rayman's hair. Is that how Rayman keeps his hair up? Is it mosquito jizz? Oh, jeez. Yeah, also, yeah, jeez, jeez, jeez. Um, yeah, also, did you guys know, because I didn't when I was a kid, in this bit, did you know you can interrupt him and knock a health bar off? Because I didn't. I used to just jump all, all over him. Give me your creamy load. Come on. There we go. One, two. Oh, well done, young man. I'm so proud of you. Oh, my God, where are you going? Yeah, I didn't know you could do that. I thought you I thought you had to just every single time he did it you had to jump or duck under him, but I didn't know you could do that. Oh, the music's the same here. And now we're friends. That's how you make friends, everybody. You punch them. Okay. Ah, uh, okay, right. Let's see what they've done here. Oh, I can use the analog stick here. Oh, fucking sweet. Oh, oh! We can come on command. It's a command. So, sorry, yeah. What's up, honey? I did, yeah. Look at this. Oh my god. Look at this. Rayman Redemption Cream Pie Edition. Whoa. This is. This is. Something else, dude. I am loving the ability to command. This is. <laughs> oh hey, hey hey photographer, is there a is is there a, a checkpoint in this bit in the original? I don't think there is. Maybe it's an invisible checkpoint. This is so good. The the the, the sound effect makes it. Oh my god, this is so funny. <laughs> Rhymony, you're my hero. <laughs> You knew that I wanted a mosquito that jizzed out of its nose and using it as an attack. You knew I wanted it and you put it in your game. And it's free. And what, what, what much more could you want? So we can upgrade the power of the gun, I suppose. Yep. Yeah, we don't seem to be going much faster. I mean, the auto-scrolling is getting slowly... Okay, so at the end, in the original, at the very ending segment, there's a speeding bit where you go really fast and you have to like react to shit really quickly. And like the music speeds up and everything, but that wasn't here. Interesting. I didn't have a problem with the speeding up bit at the end. Oh, Richardo, thank you for 200 bits. Beautiful quality of life improvements include the fact that once you obtain a collectible like a cage, present or token, they are saved forever in your collection. Yeah, I noticed that when we hit the same cage uh, from earlier and we um, managed to get ourselves some more tings. Um, you could get one, quit the level immediately, and it would still count. Well, that's awesome. Okay. So now the dog's outside. He's barking to come in, and as soon as you open the door, he runs away. He's in a he's in a weird mood tonight. Yeah. Storm Kristoff. 
Your quest has only just begun, Raymond. I'm here to help you. If you can break open 10 cages in total, I can increase your base health. Jesus Christ, this is so good. Come back once you've done that. Good luck on your journey. So now there's a reason to get everything aside from just getting a good ending, which as far as I'm aware, you can't get an ending in the original Rayman unless you get everything, which is also another thing I have a massive problem with. I think we got another token. So not only is that thou... Yeah, 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 we see. Um, oh, I don't like his face. <laughs> Do you steal my pickle? I don't know, it looks like a pickle on his nose. Let's go! Oh, okay, okay, we can't use the run-jump momentum on this bit. That's kind of annoying, but that's fine, that's fine. Do, 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 do. I prefer these, to be honest, um, over the um, mid-level bonus um, levels, because they were ridiculously, ha like, it's ridiculously hard to the point where if you make one mistake, you aren't, you aren't making it. At least here, they're separate levels, and um, you actually... Oh, he's at the door again. Oh, shit. Yeah, whereas here, you've got... You haven't got, like, all the time in the world, but you've got a little bit more time. Oh, dear. Oh, jeez. Whoopsie. But yeah, you haven't got all the time in the world, but you're, it's, it's just because it controls better and everything, it's just, it's just better in general. Okay, yep. I don't think I'm going to make it, to be honest. Yeah, I preferred the big old bassy bonk noise when you jump on these things from the original. Shit, 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 shit. Oh god, come on, eight seconds. Can I make this with one jump? See, that would have been impossible in the original Rayman. That would have been impossible. And that's not like, oh, it's a cheap way of getting to where I need to go because it still requires timing and positioning and reading. Like, it's still platforming. Like, there's a swinging thing there. And I, if I fuck up, then I lose all my progress. So it doesn't make it cheaper. It doesn't break the game. It's still challenging regardless. Okay. Oh my god. This is where Tarzan is, isn't it? I'm pretty sure. Oh my god, yes, the tooth. Yeah, I remember the tooth guard. I don't know where it went. Oh, can you help me out a little? You know, when I was a kid, I had no idea what this meant, and I always thought my game broke when I got to this point. I thought the game just broke because I was like, it's not moving, and I didn't realise it was because I needed to hit his loincloth. Also, does he still say, like, I mean, it's nice that he has a voice, but does he still go, Does he still say it? No, he didn't. He went, Did he say, Because that's the that's best thing. That's how we do it in my garden. I don't think he does. He's not saying it. What if I w walk off this way? Nah, he's not saying it. I want him to say, Oh, does he do the yodel as well? Does he do the yodeling at least? Okay, they, he's taken the sound of and he's like made it speech like Animal Crossing. He's Animal Crossing dip. It's so nearly there. It's fine. It's so nearly there. Take this bag of magic seeds as a token of my gratitude. The action button to plant them. <laughs> Look at this rain. The forest is flooding. I gotta go. Good luck. Yay! He does the yodels. At least they did that. Um, sick zero. Thank you for the two months resub. Oh, dude, even this is quicker. Planting's quicker. Yeah, the plants grow quicker. They, they, even, they even pop up a little bit higher than they do in the original as well. I'll be interested to see how fast the, um, the water climbs up. It seems to be going quite slowly. I mean, it was, I mean, it was, it wasn't unfairly fast in the original, but it was still really quick. And if you're trying to redeem Rayman, quote unquote, then I understand why it was made a lot slower. Especially if there's, if you want any chance of getting all the collectibles in order to get to the ending of the game. That's the thing, like, it's entirely possible in the original, but for one of the first levels and for the fact that you need to get everything in order to beat the game, um, it's, it is pretty, it is pretty harsh. Oh, there's more shit up there to get. 
Is the water even coming up? Yeah, it is. Oh, it's even the Pixel 80 water. Oh, so good. That's how we do it in my garden. Thank you, Nebula Aurora Twitch, for the sub. Very kind. Yeah, I never had a problem with the speed of the water in the original Rayman, but I do understand why it was changed, because if you want any chance of getting all the collectibles in order to get an ending to the game, then it makes perfect sense why... Um... Oh, we're having some weird collision slidey issues with Rayman's feet here. We're kind of sliding on top of him. That's going to get a bit confusing. Oh, uh, It's not the end of the world. It's only because he's on a tiny platform and he's turning around a lot. If we're like on a long platform, we wouldn't notice that. I'm not, no, I'm not, no, I'm not, I'm not backpedaling. I still think it's still one of my favorites. I'm just, I'm just noticing things. That's all. Even something that you love can have problems. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. It looks like I'm actually, oh, this is the most recent version, by the way, guys. So I'm not doing this on purpose. Blaze Water Sage 200 bits. Hello, Kelly. Long time no seen. How have you been? Been rewatching a lot of your videos lately. Well, thank you very much. And I'm okay, thanks. In fact, I'm better than okay because I'm playing Rayman Redemption, which is amazing. And I love it. I also like how they got rid of the animation, like in the original, when the the, ble the berries fall on the pickles' heads, they um they kind of it goes and then they go, and it's like if you need to use them as a platform to jump on them, it's impossible because their heads sway back and forth for a good two seconds or so, and then they stand still and cry and then they start moving. So if you're under time pressure or something, then it's yeah, like I said, it's impossible. That's how we do it in my garden. Something over here? I'm pretty sure... Oh. Okay. Anything up here? No. No. Alright. Cool. Down. Down. Ah! Down. Get down. Get funky. This way. And um, Baraz, thank you for the subscription. Very kind of you. Oh, wait. Oh, that grew. It didn't just appear. It grew. Oh, that's cool. It grew from Despicable Me. So that was there for a reason. So is there a secret down here? Yeah. you got to think of it. If you've been playing platformers long enough, you start looking at things like that in different ways. Okay. There we go. Right, let's move on. And I guess this opens us up to another secret? Oh no, it allows us to just get rid of those guys. Right. Okay, so in which case, that means we're able to then knock that down to then move it over to the other side of the water. No! Oh my god, that was close. There we go. Sweet. So what's down here? There has to be something down here. Well, uh, idle animations are great. Everything's great. I even love how even though it's like remastered and everything and it's really crisp, it's still all of the original backgrounds and shit. So it all, it's all looks... Oh! Fucking knockback is gone. I keep thinking there's knockback and there isn't. The game's fair now. Do you have any idea how annoying it is to have a video game where you have continues, you have limited lives, if you lose all five continues, you start from the beginning of the game all over again. But then when you're over a water or bottomless pit or something and you make one mistake and you fall and lose a life immediately. Do you have any idea how annoying that is in a game with limited continues? If, it had, if the original had unlimited continues, I don't think I'd have as much of a problem with it. But it's like when you get to some of the levels where you can't afford to get hit a single time, otherwise you're gonna like fall off and die immediately. Which, if you put into perspective, means you've got five continues. With every continue, you start the game with three lives. So if you get hit one time on a difficult bit on like something like this, you lose a life. You get hit again, you lose a life. You get hit again, you lose a life. You get hit again, you lose a life. You've lost a continue. So you that, that means you have like uh, four times five hits. You've got 20 hits in total. And then you've lost your game forever. And that's assuming you haven't lost any lives or continues up until the hard points of the game. So you get to a bit like, um, um, oh, what's it called? Yeah! 
Eat at Joe's, I think it's called. And if you get hit one time in Eat at Joe's, you lose a life immediately. So essentially, through Eat at Joe's, if assuming you have five continues, you have 20 hits to do it in one go perfectly. Otherwise, it's the end. Like, that's shit. <laughs> it's so bad. Um, how do I... Can I climb up this? I feel like I messed up, but it's okay. Oh, shit. Okay. Hopefully it will grow back. It does. Hmm. I feel like I should be able to grab onto that mushroom. Hmm. Well, I can't do anything here anyway. Oh, fuck's sake. Jesus Christ. <laughs> this isn't going very well. Oh, dear. Yeah, we go. Got it. Wait, hopefully, I should be able to tell. Oh, they've redone it. Oh, that's good to know. Yeah, the original one, you just have, you, there's a secret when you bounce down those things. And you have to, because the screen size is small and the sprite size is too big, you just have to guess when it is you need to jump. Yeah, it's there. But in the original, it pops out of nowhere. You haven't got a, you haven't got a hover or anything. You just have to do it in one go perfectly. And if you fuck up, you have to start the whole level again. And it pops out of nowhere because of the four to three aspect ratio and the fact that Rayman is half the size of the fucking screen. Okay. Okay, yep. Whoa. Anything down here? I think there was a pee down here. I think there was a bloody piss boil down here. No. Okay. It's fine. I can live without your bloody piss ball. I, th I, I don't recognize those enemies. I think they're new. Whoa, Jesus. Okay. It's like leafy pickles. Right. Now, am I going to screw myself over if I jump down here? I'm going to hover just in case. It's okay. I've got a checkpoint. And I've got 14 lives. And I've got no continues to worry about. So it's really not a big deal. So that means... Yeah, I've, st I've got still got three, yeah. I've still got three out of six, um, team, um, um, Electoons, that's what they're called, not Teen Seas, that's the second game. Oh, at some point I should stream Rayman Redemption on PS2. No, <laughs> Rayman Revolution on PS2. Rayman Redemption is what I'm playing now, Caddy. You, you smart. You smart, man. You clever, clever, man. Can I jump on that? Oh, fuck. I think that's a... Mm, I think I know how to get there. I think. I think. Oh, shit, 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 shit. So... Oh... Yeah, okay. Oh, my God. Well, I think a replay is going to have to be done anyway, but... Wow, okay. Gotcha. Yeah, a replay is going to have to be done for all the collectibles anyway, but... Um, I've got a better idea what happened here. Okay. I don't think there's a way I can get back up. Unless I somehow... Boing... No, no, I can't bounce it uphill. Okay. Right. Yeah, well, a replay was inevitable anyway because I haven't got all the power-ups, but it's good to remember that when I come back here next time, I'm bouncing off to the left and not the right. <sighs> I hate that I'm imagining that I've got... Um, that I've got... Um, hit... Um, knockback. I'm just... Every single time I get hit on any kind of water, water surface, I'm just assuming, oh, shit, I'm going to lose a life, which is one step closer to losing a continue. Oh yeah, the next one's gonna be I don't recognize this music. Is it new? Or is it from the old game and I just never got that far?
And could you imagine doing these fucking jumps without the hover? And one hit not back means you lose a life immediately in the original? Like, can you imagine? It's, it's not pleasant. It's not pleasant. In fact, it's unpleasant. Yeah, I said it. What are you gonna do about it? Oh, this is one of Raymond right Rhymany's originals. Oh, okay. It fits Rayman quite well. If he used the original um sound clips and stuff from the Rayman soundtrack as well, then that would be even better. Cause it does sound like it's a part of the Rayman soundtrack. It just it just fits. Got another bonus level. Oh, it's from the Jaguar version of the game. Oh, is it? I mean, I've never, I didn't even know it was on Jaguar, to be honest. So, um, that's, yeah, the uh, Atari's, um, oh, I, I'll tell you about the Jaguar, honey, some, um, after the stream. It's not a lot of story. It's just Atari tried to be hip and cutting edge and it fucking failed, like. Oh, so that, okay, so the, apparently, according to chat, the Jaguar version of this game has exclusive tracks and this is one of them. So this isn't a Rhymony original then. Right. Well, that's cool. In which case, like someone else in the chat was saying that they um they didn't like how some of the music was unfit was um unfitting. It didn't fit with the levels. But I'm not going to complain because the original PS1 game had great music, but it reused a lot of music. Um, and I'm glad that instead of reusing the same amount of music, especially with all the new sh the new level designs and shit they added in here. Um, I'm actually glad that they've um, given everyone a taste of um, all the other music. Because if it was in the Jaguar version and it's it saves you replaying another another song that you've already heard a million times in another part of the game, then why not include it? I don't mind. Jeez, look at us go. It's so weird to see Rayman running and like hair gliding in this level design it's so weird he does look happier yes right yeah whether or not like you think the jaguar music is any good or not is is another th thing entirely but i think using it here along with all the other soundtracks is a great idea because otherwise you're just going to be reusing the same um the same songs over and over and over again which is what the original does So if you can, um, yeah, replace one of the song replays with another song that appears in another version of another Rayman game, which is the same Rayman game, then it's like, why not? I don't know how many of these guys there are. There we go. Sweet. Anything up here? No, can I... Ah, <laughs> you tried to pull a sneak on me, didn't you? Didn't you? Although saying that, I think I should probably go back. I'm not going to make it, am I? No, I'm fine. I'm fine. Yeah, there's probably something along here that I missed. Let's just see. Let's just grab this again. Yeah, I don't think we can increase the power, um, but we can keep increasing the speed, so that's something. Anything here? No? Okay. Okay, let's have a look here. Down, down in the brow. Oh! Okay, well, in the original, you're just a standard enemy. You're not even a boss. And I never figured out, I never figured out how to beat you. Oh, you hit the lips. I had no idea you did that. Yeah, in the original, that's just a regular enemy. Oh my God. And there was, I, I, could, I, I didn't realise you had to hit the lips in the original because it doesn't make it clear at all if it's even being hit. Because the, hitting its body is the same as hitting its lips. The same thing happens, so. Dude, it's a mini bosses and everything. Yeah, that should have been a mini boss in the original now that I think about it. Yeah, that thing was annoying in the original. Like, you couldn't even jump over it. You just had to sacrifice a, sacrifice a heart for it. 
if you wanted to run through it, or if you knew how to beat it already, which I didn't. Okay, cool. So I think the P's are armor. You can re you can regen three hit points, the three yellow ones, but you can't regen the P's unless you find another P. I don't know, but they're funny when you when when you say them. Oh, that's the bit where you go up the. Okay, it wasn't that the, the other level. There was a I knew there was a level in one of the forests where going up to the top right, top left, sorry, made a made one of them appear. Oh Jesus, you were hiding. I didn't see you. Yeah, I, I swore to God that one of them was hiding. Yeah, I can't jump up there. Oh my God, I remember this in the original as well. See, jumping from these things in the original, they get faster and faster and faster, and getting the timing right on the jump, again, you've got one shot, otherwise you lose a life. Getting the timing right on the jump when your jump is this, insanely difficult. And if you make one mistake, you lose your life. One step closer to losing a continue. Yeah, that's been fixed. I'm, I'm really, really glad about that. Oh my god. That was really close. It's got to be something down here. Oh, right. I didn't realize that it did that. Okay. Well, even though we've got unlimited continues and it's way more lenient with shit like this, I'm still going to collect as many lives as possible. I haven't had to use crawl. Well, I, I have a few times, but not massively amounts. Oh my god! Is there a is there a blue ball around here? Oh, I need to. How do I get there? Can I get up here? Do I have to make it materialize like in the other levels? Oh shit! Missed you. Hmm. Maybe I go back. Yeah. Maybe I. Maybe I. Oh Jesus! Okay, wait, wait, wait. No, I don't think I don't think I can reach the tops of those vines. Nah. I'm also glad I took the skidding feet off. Oh, they don't do that. I like it when they go. So how do we get up there? You answered my question immediately. So it's really cool how Rayman 1 in general does its secrets, because um, how it does its secrets is that the secrets are hidden behind when you stand in particular places. And aside from moments later on in the game where you have to stand in random places to make actually important things pop up, which is just, I hate that. Aside from a few moments in the late game where you have to just guess where hidden shit is, um, for a lot of the time, you go towards a power-up or a bit of health or something, which then makes something else appear. So you could look at it and go, oh, I don't need that bit of health, but actually you might benefit from doing it because there might be a secret there. How the hell do I get up there? Hmm. I don't know how you get up there. Do you think maybe you got to, like, jump onto the top of here? Oh, my God. Yeah, and then... Nah. Hmm. Probably a power-up that I haven't got yet. I couldn't see a transparent thing. Hmm. Oh, there has to be a... There has to be a way... Oh, wait, 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 wait! No, I know what to do! These things fling, fling you up, don't they? Oh, they used to. Okay, they used to fling you back up. Huh. I wonder. Yeah, they don't fling you back up anymore. Unless this one does? No, they all do the same thing. No. Um... I'm going to work this out. You know me, guys. I always work it out eventually. Oh, shit. Okay. That's what I'm thinking. That's my guess right now. Oh, bollocks to you. Oh, it's so good to play 
the the presentation and imagination of the original Rayman in this way with all the controls and everything. Do you think it sounds like a squeaky bed? Well, it sounds like two old people dying while they fuck. That's what it sounds like. Is this going to do it? No. Uh... Hmm. Up, shoot through there. Hmm. There has to be something to do with this. Oh. There we go, right. So that's one of the secrets where you're given no clues. Um, but at least that's not impossible to figure out. That's how we do it in my garden. Right, so now that there's an enemy there, I was going to say, more things are going to start appearing, aren't there? Shit, panic. So if more shit starts appearing, that must mean that other shit's going to appear um, later on. I think I've got some sort of... Oh, fucking hell. Ah... Uh... Okay, right. Let's try this again. I think this is the best this is the best idea I have. Might not be perfect. Oh, I heard a twinkle. I heard a magic tinkle. Maybe it wasn't for this bit. Maybe that's what I've got to do. Maybe I just got to fly over and No, but then I've got to do it like 5 times, don't I? They've thought about that. Rhymey, you've thought about this, haven't you? You've thought about people that would um want to do that because you need to you need to be on the same um, position of it in order to um oh there's a life up there yeah you need to be on this you need to be next to it in order to get the collectible in the first place otherwise it's impossible I appreciate that you can't cheese it well I mean as much as it is nice to hear the old music again it's also nice to see um Oh shit, I did the wrong thing again. <laughs> oh no. Yeah, it's nice it's nice that they've also got the atmospheric like forest noises and shit back as well. Yeah, it knows it knows when to be quiet, when to be loud. If anything though in the original just made it extra scary because <laughs> you have no idea what's going to pop out, what's going to murder you. Oh, I I think I must have been on the right track because there's no piranha there. There's no piranha there now. So I activated a piranha, but why would it want me to activate a piranha? Ah, uh, okay. I'm on the right track. I am certain I'm on the right track. I just need to work out what it is the track is. Okay, right. So we go down here. Oh, I should probably activate the checkpoint, shouldn't I? I don't know why I didn't do that last time. Hello? F oh, hello, Finland. Gotta say, your, your country has a very clever man living in it. Because he made this game for nothing. I thank Finland for this game. It's a Finnish remake of a French game. The question is, how many moustaches were in the office? Oh, okay, you weren't there before. Okay, wait... Okay, I, I'm supposed to follow the breadcrumbs. I see. So now you're telling me where I can go. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so the hints were all there. I just wasn't paying attention to the level design. That was all. Oh, I can't hit that. Um, can I make it? Can I bait it out? Okay. Um, I, I can sacrifice health. I don't mind. I need to. I need to be. I need to do it from up top anyway. So, 
Oh, shit. Oh, okay, we can bait it down from here. Okay, all right. And they don't come back. Great. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Oh, fucking hell. Okay, um... It's fine. I can do this with one hit left. It's fine. Good. We did it, guys. I didn't need any help. Yeah, that was pretty straightforward. I mean, it, okay, it was secretive, but if you were paying attention to the level design, you'd know where you basically whenever Rayman does secrets like that, you follow the direction of what what new appeared, whether it's an enemy or a ting or a new power up like you just follow the direction of whatever new popped up and then you end up finding the next clue I don't think I'm supposed to be able to do this I think I've oh god I'm blind faith here yeah I think I oh I don't know I'm gonna I'm gonna go back through here just to make sure I'm probably okay but I just want to be sure Ah, so now it's a hostel of old people that are fucking as they die. And the question now is, is it the bed squeaking or is it the old person choking? Who knows? Oh, no! But we, it's all right, we got the collectibles. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We got the collectibles. I'm pretty sure we did anyway. Present? Yeah. Yeah, we're fine. Okay, cool. In which case, I'm going to take the cheap way, because it's safer. I also prefer the softer helicopter sound effect as well, like the RC copter sound effects. In the original, it's like a saw blade. It's like, every time you use the hair. And I'm glad that they've changed that as well. I'm saying they, it's one person. I mean, Jesus Christ, he changed that. I need to remember that. He, 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 he. Michael Jackson. Hee <laughs> hee. Oh, oh, hey, hi, Michael. So, oh, okay, right. So this is going to take us to where the new life is, which I'm going to take, obviously. So after this should be um, the mosquito boss fight, the second one. Pushed me off. I wasn't looking at the screen. That was entirely my fault. Oh, dear. I wasn't looking. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Please forgive me and my bad game. Yeah, that saw blade noise. I mean, again, it's classic sound effects and shit, but it did get old after a while. It's also weird to be playing Rayman 1 on a DualShock 4 as well. Very weird. It's like nostalgic, but at the same time, not at all. Right, let's try this again. I've got my old fist back. So you still get punished for dying aside from going back to the checkpoint and losing a life. You lose your fist powers. Or at least lose quite a bit of them. So I've lost my power. I've lost the gold, the goldness of the fist, and I've lost a bit of speed on it as well. So it doesn't go too it doesn't go too easy on you. I think if I went on to um the revamped mode, I'm on classic mode, aren't I? So if I went to the revamped mode, that would have been too easy, I think. I'm glad I went with this. I don't want to lose my fisting ability, no. Because my fisting is good for fisting people in the face and also fisting my way up cliffs. Okay, how do we get up there? That's how we do it in my garden. Do we... Hmm... I'm assuming we have to just make, make, a, make a good jump, I guess. I've put you in a very awkward place. Um, Kieranol, thank you so much for the resub for four months. Love the stream, Caddy. Any chance you'd review Simpsons games in a video similar to the Tony Hawk one? Perhaps. I can't promise, but I, I might do. Okay, we need to just get it. Yep. Done it. Good. A li little bit trickier than the earlier ones. Patchable stream. Thank you for the sub. Oh, Hello. Oh, okay, I was going to say, what happens if I run away from you? He follows you, the speed follows you, so if I go too fast, he, f he speeds up with me. I like that, okay. 
Oh, jeez. Okay, I'm going to probably miss a load of secrets here now that I look at it. So, I don't think I can trick him, can I? No, I can't. No, I can't get around him. Oh, dude. Okay, right. This is the saddest chase music, isn't it? I love it, but it's the saddest chase music I've ever made. God, that was way easier than the original. Right, so is he gone gone? Can I, like, have a look around here now? It's really stressful and really, like, urge... Uh, it, oh, maybe I could just go all the way back through the level. You couldn't do that in the original, as far as I'm aware. The, ga the game's auto-scroller kicked you off. But yeah, it's it's very sad, you know, sad violins, sad gongs. I didn't realise gong could be sad until Raymond on the police DT. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, oh my god. So now this gives me chance, yeah, this gives me a chance to then get that thing off of the top of there. Anything else around here I can grab? Yeah, the original didn't allow you to do this, I'm pretty damn sure. There we go. Anything back where he started? Yeah, there has to be. There's a hand up here. No? Okay. Yeah, it's a, it's a very it's a very sorrowful chase sequence. It's like it's like a, it's like if dark it's like if Dark Souls had a, has a chase sequence in it. It's like if Dark Souls had a boulder chase or like a chase against like an old like owl. An old owl that was the size of a giant. And it's like the, the owl had a tragic backstory and like it was betrayed by the old king because the old king didn't give him his magic cloak. And he want, and he got angry and needs to chase you. It's that kind of music. It's Dark Souls sorrowful, sad, but also urgent chase music. Oh yes it is. Oh yeah, Richardo in the chat's right. Yeah, no, it's a very easy download. In fact, to make sure this was the most updated version, I downloaded it three minutes before the stream started. It's about a gigabyte in size because um, there's um, music files and data files, um, but the executable itself is about 100 megabytes. But it, um, yeah, the music is where all the memory goes to. But yeah, so it's only about it's only about a gigabyte's worth of a download. But it's in a, actually no, it's in a zip folder, so it's even smaller. Maybe it is a gigabyte. I don't know. But it was it was it was a very easy um, download. You're right. Yeah. Oh, dude, is that a is that a Corona thing? Fight the virus. Oh, what? What does that mean? Fight the virus. What is that? Are you talking about COVID? Is this Ray? Is it is this ra is this Rayman raving rabid because he's got rabies? Is that is that? Is that what we're saying? I mean, I got an achievement, and I got a power-up which I haven't seen before. It's, it just gives me max power on my fist, which is pretty cool. But that's pretty funny. <laughs> oh, that's really sweet. I like, I like how you've hidden... Well, I mean, you've hidden it in the game, so obviously you don't want everybody to fight the virus. Otherwise, it would have been easier to find. Um, so I know how you feel about, um, you know, people dying from the virus, right, Mini? I'm disappointed. But either way, that's very cute. It's reminding people what they have done through the pandemic and through lockdown. This dude made this game. Maybe there should be another graffiti somewhere in the game which says, Ubisoft, give me money or hire me. Like just a, a little hidden Easter egg. Of, um, please give me a job in game development because holy shit. I would like, I mean, if Rayman 1, the original, if, if the original Rayman 1 is available on the PS1, no, I mean the PS Store, on um, for your PS3 and PS Vita, then I have no reason to not think, like, I just wouldn't buy it. There's no point. If it's, if they're selling the original version, they're selling, um, an inferior product. This is the, this is the superior product. And I would not pay money for the original Rayman on the PS Store, but I would happily pay for this. Have it running on, like, fucking PS4, PS5, Switch. I would, like, do something. Ubisoft, do something good for once in your miserable existence and give this man a job. 
Or actually, maybe... Uh, uh, okay, don't give him a job, he's shit. Right. Okay, so you lose... You lose the gold power and you lose one speed every time you die. Okay. So the gold power is only is counted as one power up. Okay. It's a separate it's a separate entity. Whereas the speed is counted as multiple power ups. I wonder what the tings are used for. I just keep getting them. I've got 399. Okay, I'm gonna hang here and see what happens. Ooh. Yeah, okay. See, that's the kind of secret in Rayman you got to look out for. you got to think, why is that place there? There's usually always a reason why shit's placed in certain places. Yeah, see? Good. Wow. I even, I even, I wasn't even paying attention and I walked under your attack there, dude. This is another great, another great bit of music from the game. Ah, uh, yes, I remember. He, he drops all of the spiky things. Yeah. I remember when when I got here as a kid. I mean, I'm talking obviously as a kid. Doing it nowadays, even on the original, it isn't that difficult. But I remember as a kid, this stressed me out like nothing else, especially with like Rayman's walking speed and everything. Like here, you've just got so much more control. But then that also means yeah, he's going to drop more shit, garden. and he's going to surprise me more often. But yeah, like, getting to this point as a kid, um, and seeing, like, a red version of the Mosquito you just beat, and he's dropping all of this shit, and you don't know what to do there, and then you think, oh yeah, ducking. And then you've, you're on, like, your last life, and you don't know what his attack's going to be, and he's red, and he's aggressive, and he's scary, and the music's scary, and it's, like, amping you up for an epic fight and everything. Yeah, this this used to stress me out as a kid. Game Busters, thank you for the sub. Oh, we both hit each other at the same time. Double KO. Um, Patchable Stream, thank you for the sub. Did I already say thank you to Patchable Stream? I don't know. Maybe I, maybe I didn't. Oh, shit. He's getting he's getting the better of me. And what, well, also, that's another thing seeing as a kid as well. The health bar. You see the health bar and you're like, well, damn, mine's not that big. Oh, he he does a nose jizz as well. He does it more often, though. So he's been pent up for quite some years. I'm sorry. It's, I'm sorry that happened. It's just been, it's been such a long time, and you're so attractive. Oh, dear. I think, yeah, no, I think you're right, Lobo Bobo. I think he is getting faster. Like, in the original, he got faster, but because you've got more control, there he, um... Right Manny is compensating by making him faster, which is a good balance to make. If you had this control with the original boss fight, like, it would just be, it would be ridiculously easy. He actually managed to hit me a few times, so that's pretty good. Uh, I love how we don't make friends. I love how we don't make friends with that one. We made friends with the pink one. Because pink is a pussy color. And then the red one comes in and it's like, Ah, oh, no, too scary. He needs to die. Thanks for releasing us. Ah. So that's where they came from. They came from the stomach of a rock frog. That's a question I didn't need answering, but I'm glad it's being answered right now. We are forever grateful and will now help you on your quest. Grab us with your fist to swing and reach new locations. I will. I will indeed. Thank you so much. Oh, now I'm going through it. Wait. So where did they come from? So if you've got a, if you've got a mouse and an ass a mouth and an asshole, where do they come from? Up your head? Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm just grabbing all the tings while I can because I don't I don't know what they're for yet. Can I go here? No. Whoop. Oh, there's sound effects. I'm pretty sure in the PS1 there isn't a grabbing sound effect. You just do it. Oh my god, this is going to make some of the later levels much more manageable because you don't have to you don't have to worry about like fucking like not being able to That's another thing because there's levels later on in the game in the original where you've got those pink hook things but they're over bottomless pits. So you have to jump and then aim well you can't even aim your fist, but you have to fist you have to time your fist strike perfectly otherwise you fall to the bottomless pit and you die and you lose a life. So here at least we've got 
well, better, better mid, like better jump control, and we've also got the hover, so we can do a lot more with what we've got. You've assembled the forest medallion. New items unlocked in the shop. Oh, right. Okay, well, I didn't realize. Wait, shop? Where is the shop? Where is what? What shop? Extras? Rayman skin? Oh, well, that's what they meant by skin. Oh, oh, this is cool. Even this is cool. There's so many, there's so like there's achievements and like oh fucking hell, and there's codes. So there's cheats. Uh, I, I can't go back. Rhymini, I can't go back from the cheat screen. Now you have, now you're giving me no choice but to put ah code wrong. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I don't know where the shop is. Oh, I'll, I'll unlock it later. Okay, cool, awesome. Oh, band lands there now. Okay, well, seeing as though, oh no, I'm gonna actually, I'm gonna go back through the game once I've got all the power ups. I think, um, because I, I don't remember what levels have what power ups in them, so there's no point replaying them all over again to then miss one um, cage of electoons. Um, because I need the spring power up as well as the um, the hooky swingy power up. Right, let's do it. What we got going on here? Oh, we get to, oh. Oh, this is That's oh, how this is nasty. In my garden. This is really nasty. <laughs> I don't like this. Wait, can I not? Can I not plant? Are you kidding? Oh damn. Okay. Okay, so the timer isn't going down. Uh oh, fuck. Unlimited lives. Oh, okay. So the timer's not going down. I've got unlimited lives, and it seems as though I could only plant once. I'm not sure. Wait a minute. Let's see. No, okay. I, I don't know what that was about then. Anything up here? Ah, I can cheat. Oh no, that's what you're supposed to do. Oh, I thought I had to do a massive glide. Oh, okay. Well, in which case, I know the speedrunning tactics straight away. I'm going to play it safe though. Harper, thank you for 200 bits. I'll read it in a second. Okay. Yeah, I know the speed running tactic for this level then. Ah, oh, I need to remember to hold the button again. Um, last donation. Would you be um, down for playing my game once I'm finally finished making it? Yeah, well, look, send it to my email and shit. And I'm absolute, absolutely. Streaming it, I can't promise because that's up to the patrons. But um, yeah, no, absolutely. There was another. There was another person that used to... Used to. He still watches my streams. But there was another person who made a game on the i the iOS store called Dribble, free to download, pixel art game where you you control a bouncy ball um, going through levels. It's really fun, and it's free, so you're not losing out um, by by you're not missing any. No, you're not losing out on anything by trying it. Sorry, you're not losing any money or anything. So yeah, I'd recommend that. Oh, and E E what D T has subscribed. E W O O T, I think that says. Okay, right. I just need to. There we go. Gotcha. So this is gonna properly test how you use your new moves in the game, I suppose. I keep forgetting. I keep forgetting to press the dead button, actually. Yeah, this is gonna really test. You've got all these new controls and shit. Now you're gonna fucking do it. <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna speed run it. You think it's starting with if you're happy and you know it? If you're happy and you know it, no. No, I don't hear it, honey. Yeah, but I'm, I'm thinking of the beginning of the song and I don't hear it. Okay, right. So, okay, yep. Yeah. Okay, we have to get rid of those guys, otherwise the, the... Yeah, that gets stuck on their heads and we need it to get up here. Oh, shit. What? Oh, okay. Oh, wait, no, we've got the seeds. Oh, Jesus Christ. Sorry, I'm a bit slow tonight. 
So now we're climbing up this. Jesus, damn it. God, I, I would like to see someone speed running this shit. Ah. Uh, yeah, with three hits and everything. This is a good challenge. I'm. Uh, this is really cool. And again, it's all original. This is all made up by Rymany. So he didn't only give you the best version of the original Rayman, but also gave you all this other shit as well. Which is not only brilliantly done, but you'd be mistaken for thinking it was part of the original to begin with. Fits in the style, fits in the design, fits in the imagination. Now where do I go? What? Well, what? Oh, I need to remember I've got the seeds. Caddy seeds. Everyone in chat, just put it in big capital letters. Caddy seeds. There we go. Right, so now what happens? Yep, we had a tinkle. What did the tinkle do? Something down here? Yes, there we go. Thank you, chat. Now I'll remember that our Caddy has That's seeds. That's how we do it in my garden. Oh, jeez. No, I fucked it up. I fucked it up. I fucked it up. Oh, no. I saved myself. Okay. Okay. They've they've thought about that, clearly. <gasps> no. Okay. Yeah, I don't care how long this takes me. I'm just going to do it. If there's an achievement related to getting the time perfect or something, I... Well, we'll, we'll see. We'll see what happens. The Flosh, thank you for subscribing. You can see what I was trying to do. I was trying to um, grab to the edge here. Yeah, that's it. Do the Mr. Scops method. Still going. Seeds, thank you. I've never heard this far into the song, to be honest with you. Because in the original, they don't give you any bloody time. It just it ends before it even starts. Yeah, that's the beginning of the song, honey. Oh, that. Du, 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 that bit. Oh, right. Oh, I see. <gasps> no! Oh, fuck. I thought it bounced off the screen. Oh, damn it all. Uh, all over again. I think what I'm going to do, I'll probably do a world per stream. Uh, oh, fuck. <laughs> I do use this in my videos, but they, but yeah, they don't, it doesn't ever pop up that long. It doesn't pop up long enough for me to hear the rest of the song. I cut it off before it gets going. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, fuck. Oh, damn it. I've lost all my health already on the first bit. Okay. Okay, I just need to get past here, which won't be a problem, I hope. Okay, we're fine. Let's keep going. Okay. It. Okay, seed. There we go. I remembered. Oh my god, I've got one hit remaining and I'm really stretching it. <laughs> I am pushing my luck in multiple places here. Oh shit. I thought I could attack him from here. That was my fault. Yeah, I think I think yeah, a world per, st per stream is a good idea, especially considering that this is taking up quite a lot of my time. No, oh fuck it, who cares? Oh. Okay, haven't lost a hit point yet. This is going well. Yeah, speedrunner incoming. 
Oh shit. Oh fuck. Oh shit. Actually, maybe having this on their heads would actually be beneficial. Yeah, I think that might actually help us out. <laughs> now that I look at it. Ooh. Oh, that was real. That okay. That was too much of a piss take there. I'm sorry, game. I shouldn't have done that. Oh wow. Oh, he nearly tickled my fanny. Oh god. Okay, so I just need to just get around him in that case. Just ignore him. He's fine. He's okay laughing to himself and shooting at nothing. Yeah, that's fine. <sighs> oh, God. Ah. No. Okay, this is where we use a seed again. Yep. I just grabbed the edge of that. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Yep. Yep, then we come back down, and then what happens here? There should be another dude in flowers. Yep, he's camouflaged. I like that enemy, because, I, I, again, I don't recognize him from the original, but, like, if he's a new enemy, I like how he blends into the background, so he's not just a new random version of the same enemy with a different skin. He's a completely fresh idea for an enemy in Rayman 1. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, seed, seed. Okay. Mm, this is probably dangerous. Okay, this is where I got to last time. So I've been given the speed. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. I've been given the speed boost so that I'm able to take this guy down, I'm pretty sure. I'm going to actually attempt to hover underneath. Shit. Oh, God, don't hit me! Oh, my God, that was close. So, I can't quite make it. Yes, I can. Oh, God. Slow down, me. Jesus Christ, don't get too cocky. Oh, fucking hell. Okay, um... I'm assuming if I go down, I die, so I just need to... I just need to time it right. Oh, fuck. I don't know. Um... Oh, jeez. I don't know. I don't want to... No. <laughs> I don't want to do this. You can't make me do this, Rymany. No. I think that's my chance there. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Yeah. Okay. We're fine. We're good. Um, and that's my chance there. So I've got to follow that on the way out. Oh, bloody hell. Okay. But then I'm going to clip my head on the top one, surely. Oh, fucking hell. Ah. Oh, my God. We done it yet? Done it yet? No? Oh, God. Can I not have some health or something? Oh, God. Wait, you're up there. Okay. Anything else down here? Yes, health. Oh, my God. Thank the Lord. Okay, right. And the Lord in this case is Rymany, because he is better than God for making this game. See, if this kind of... This is the funny thing, isn't it? If this kind of challenge was in Sackboy, I would have been so fucking bored and, like, so... Yeah, like, it just goes to show that, like, ch it's not about, oh, it's challenge and you rage quit over challenge. If, if something's too boring, you don't bother with the... Like, if you feel like the challenge is unfair, then why fucking bother? Why give the game any more of your any more benefit of the doubt if you think it was already unfair to begin with. And it was already mediocre, so it was like it didn't really help anybody. Oh, God. Yeah, if this, if this kind of challenge was in Sackboy, I, I would have quit the game way before World 1. <laughs> oh, come on, Pickle. Oh. Yep. Okay, now what? You seize a seed. This is long. This is longer than I was expecting. I guess that's why there's a, a clock that um, that just counts up instead of counting down because if you saw like five minutes on the countdown clock you probably wouldn't want to try going as fast as you can oh there's got to be something up here no? no okay yeah this is just showing it's just uh, it's just telling you how fast you are able to do it there's the that's the ending oh come on that didn't hit really? 
That also didn't hit. Oh my god, I don't like this at all. Okay, I'm going to try something. No. Yep, yeah, there we go. That was actually pretty difficult. And that's with all the new, like, physics tweaking, no knockback, better controls, all the power-ups and all that shit. Wow. That was really good. That was really good. Damn. Well, do you know what I think? I think that calls for the new and improved DJ. DJ! 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 Yeah! Dictionary. Back to the map. Yep, we've I I I I I increased it. I changed it, everybody. From the last time, it it just stopped at yeah, but I put dictionary at the end because it was it was too good not to. I'm thinking though I should probably make it yellow or something. I need to make the text more visible. Yeah, I need to do something else. Save game, game saved. Look at that. Jeez. Um, yeah, I, I'm sorry this wasn't the longest stream in the world, but I, I want to try and do like one one world per. Um, anyway. Sorry, main menu. Exit to main menu. Yeah, it shouldn't be sold. Quick game. Look at that. Awesome. Abs absolute. Absolute bliss. That was that was bliss. Taking something with the highest potential in the universe and making it so much better. But anyway, yeah, let's um let's find somebody to raid. Why not? And somebody cheered some bits actually. Richardo, two hundred bits on the base health too. Maybe the magician challenges are easier once you get permanent health upgrades. I don't know. Oh wow, that was me just then. Wow, I echoed. Sorry about that. Um, let's raid. Um, oh, let's raid Super Butter Bun. She's playing some Kingdom Hearts 2 right now. If you don't know who Super Butter Buns is, she's got the funniest voice, so, um, that's all you need to know. And she's obsessed with Kingdom Hearts. And we may be doing, doing something, like a cameo or something, in a future thing, maybe. Did I need to say that? I don't know. I've said it now too late. Anyway... We are going to raid Super Butter Buns, everybody. Thank you for joining with Rayman Redemption. I think so far with just World 1, he's already been redeemed more than I ever expected. And um, I hope to see you on Monday with more Rayman Redemption. Stay safe, everybody. Um, and... Mwah.